Hello today, and today we're going to have a game of Daily Double Horse Racing on the Commodore 64. Now, this is a game I had back in the day on the Commodore Amiga, so basically what it is, it's a horse racing betting game. Um, right, so it is a disc game, so it takes ages to load, so you can speed up the emulation on this, which is always a good thing. Um... Right, so you can have up to four players on this, so just me. Choose the amount you wish to start. So we just start with about $100, because it's just a review at the end of the day. Pick track conditions, turf, dry, muddy, random. All right, let's have random, spice things up a bit. Track conditions for these, 10 races will be turf. Please make a note of this. Right, okay, I ain't not gonna make a note of it, but view race one. So, four furlongs, so, so they're all represented in colour, so it gives you the name of the that Lone Ranger Saddle Upstand. So, oh, right, so the one in the top is the name of the horse, one at the bottom is the um, name of the jockey. Right, okay, so we've got 14 to 1, 15 to 1, um, 11 to 1, 13 to 1, 7 to 5, right. So, okay. So, place a bet. Place a bet. So, win. Obviously, win. Place. Show. Partly win. Daily double. Right, we'll just go for a win. So, we go for white. You have selected white. Okay. So, let's choose. Let's have a $20 bet. As we started off with um, M bet, right? Okay, your bet was twenty dollars. End your turn, right? So this will take us to the race. The horses are at the starting gate. Whoopee! Now it was another horse racing game that I did have back in the day on the Amstrad CPC four six four. Was a game called Sporter Kings. That wasn't too bad. So here we go. So we're the white horse which we're trailing right oh yeah we're doing quite badly <laughs> so we're in fourth place or is that third place was that the first furlong right then fur four furlongs so that must have been the first furlong so we've got parallax scrolling going on here oh so they do move about the horses then okay Now I'm fucking uh, well, well, when else our fucking us all saying even on the screen anymore? Yeah, so finish. So that's a nice, nice way. I think this looks more. It's better than the media version, actually. What the hell is all crashed? <laughs> Results of race one. So, well, we lost there, didn't we? So, race one completed. Let's have a look at race two. Right, so don't. Let's just go for. I think betting for the 30 to 1. Maybe we go for. Let's go for. Nicknack. Nicknacks. 4 to 1. I know it's a 3 to 1. Let's go for the 4 to 1. So. Place bet. Win white again. Alright, so let's put oh let's put a twenty dollar bet on it. End bet, right, okay. View your bets, end your turn. Right, okay. So you can do multiple bets if you want to. So the horses are at the starting gate again. Right. There we go. So when the white horse, remember the white horse again. I was a fucking bet on the black horse. Mind you, it's the bottom horse that's doing the best. Come on, for fuck's sake, stick a turbocharger up his ass. So look, horse is falling back. So we're doing absolutely crap again. 
Come on, you stupid bastard horse, come on! So it's almost like, look! So, so this is a longer race, this is an eight furlong race. So, you might be just holding back, you know, because it's a longer race, might just use up the energy at the end. So, furlong finishes four, I see. Yeah, no, perhaps it's done now. Fucking hell, come on. Furlong's finished five. Now we're even out of the screen. We're fucked. We ain't going nowhere in this game. Alright, so six furlongs finished. Now we're out of this. Alright. No. Lost this one. Furlong. So it's the finish. Oh, we didn't come last. That's amazing. <laughs> right, another fuck up we made there with the betting. Right, Mount lost again. Right, let's have a view of the third race. So 13 to 1, 11, 3 to 2. You know what? We'll go for the blue horse. Place a bet. Let's go for a win, actually. Oh. Was it dark blue, wasn't it? Right. Dark blue. Let's put another $20 on it. Right. End your turn. And let's go to the... The horses are at the starting gate. Right, so we'll dark blue this time. Let's see how fucking good this horse does. If not, we'll shoot the bastard thing if it loses. Here we go. Oh, he's in the lead. He's in the lead. Mind you, the, the odds were the best. But the problem is, the lower the odds, the less money you get. But I suppose getting some money is a result. Yep, look, he's pissing it out. He's pissing it out, look. He's in the lead. It's fucking flying. Look at that. So we're finally going to get some money. So how many furlongs? It's a uh, six furlong race. Yep. So we've won this one. Oh, don't say nothing yet, because the oh, we're the only two horses on the screen, look. Every, every, oh, not, and even the white horses go about to get scrolled out of the screen, look. So, <laughs> so one more furlong to go, and I, my horse is the only, only horse in the screen. Everything else has been scrolled out. <laughs> what a dominant horse. All the others are quite together, actually. Wow. Right, dark blue, right. Okay. So how much? Oh, 149 quid. 49 dollars, rather. So, for a 20 dollar bet. Okay. So let's do race four. I'll probably make this one the last one. Because we see how the game plays. It's just betting. Right, so Dark Major, so Capelli. Right, so the three to two odds or the L Clipper. Let's go for the two to one. Place bet. Try a different bet. Let's try a place. Oh, I've forgotten the fucking colour. Let's view it. So let's go for um, the dark blue and the white. Dark blue and the white. I think that's what the place. Is. 
maybe it's a different back then also picked was dark blue let's just go all out I've got now my oh right so I got right let's go for 85 let's go for an 85 and see what happens right and turn horse is at the starting gate now maybe your place is first second or third it's probably like an each way bet I think that's why it's known in the UK is an each way bet I don't know I don't know nothing about betting so we are the dark, the dark blue horse And we're not doing very well at the moment, so we're trading. Well, we're fucking trading right behind now, aren't we? So it's fourth place at the moment. And this is an eight furlong race. Yeah. So it's between uh, White Horse and uh, Mauve Horse. Well, we're fighting for third place, maybe. No, it's between us, between the green and the blue. Oh, I think I lost it. So, between the white and the mauvels, we have um, four furlongs to go. Uh, I honestly think this is better than the Amiga version, to be honest with you. Graphics look alright, what parallax, uh well they're alright, do the job. So another two furlongs to go, we're almost out of the fucking screen now, look. So I've wasted all that money, so one more furlong to go. And the horse my horse has been scrolled out. So I've only got four dollars left. There we go. Oh, look at that! Fucking almost last. Oh, that didn't go too well, did it? Right, results to lost. Yeah, I know. Right, so let's have a view of race five. Right, let's go for the light blue, thirty to one. I'll make this one the last go. Place bet. So we go for a win. Right, blue. Alright. So we've got four dollars. So nothing left. So four dollars on the highest. <laughs> On the highest um, view of oh, what's it? The uh, stats, you know. Uh, so that's the light blue. And all immediately we're fucking losing. Look at that. So we lost all our money now and we're fighting for last place. Look. In fifth place, so this is a three furlong race. So it's a short race, and we're doing absolute shit. We're almost out. Of, we're almost scrolled out the screen. Look, look, we are scrolled out the fucking screen now. Look, so we've lost all our money. <laughs> yeah, this is all right. This game, it's all right. So you can play up to four players. So that would be quite interesting. And we come near enough last or did, no we did come last did we? yeah there's a light blues right so so I've got no money so it's pointless continuing right so hang on so you have so really there's no much no but no not really 
any point continuing I've got no money so there's hardly any point continuing the game unless you know I suppose you can view the races I guess if you're playing more players if they've got money you still participate even though you got fuck all money you just do fuck all so at least you got the end bet so final bet was nothing then you can end your turn view all your bets 15 more possible bets well I can't bet because I've got nothing no money alright yeah so you can still carry on playing if you've got other players I guess but if you've got no money it's pointless carrying on might as well just quit the game yeah but it's alright though it's alright it's not bad you know for a horse racing betting game and I would definitely go to say this is better than the Amiga version anyway gonna end this now thank you so much for watching until next time and goodbye